Hello, welcome back to another hashtag Scrappy Monday embellishment hosted by Tony from Tony's Witchy Art and Crafts and myself. This is an open collaboration, so you are welcome to join in at any time, hop in and out as you please. Um, we do post on the last Monday of the month. And make sure if you post to just use the hashtag and tag me and Tony so that we can find your video and watch it because we are so excited to see what everybody else's ideas are. It's so fun. Um, we all have so unique, so it's really fun to see what everybody else comes up with. And the only rule is not to buy anything. You just use your scraps to make embellishments. However, I do recognize that some of the things I've made are technically ephemera instead of embellishments but make whatever comes to you whatever you feel like making and post it we're happy to see what it is and um everybody's just so creative i just love it so i can't wait to see what everybody makes today i decided to use my scraps with my little envelope punch board today this is from we are memory keepers like it, it's got the teeniest little bone folder <laughs> so cute and then um so it's the mini envelope punch board and uh it has the little the little um you know corner rounder you can use it on this side for the corner rounder or it punches the notches on the envelope and I just pulled out some paper scraps and made a little envelope cluster. You can see here that in, I made three different envelopes and clustered them together. I love this paper. I kind of hate to cover that up, but... And then I also used scraps to make a bunch of little tags. I was trying to be fancy and cut these little fancy tags and I even poked holes because I was like, oh, I'm going to put something in the top and then... I realized I needed a couple more tags because it just wasn't full enough and I was <laughs> I went with just chopping the corners on those ones because it took forever and then I realized I didn't have all of my fibers and everything I can't get poked through those little tiny holes so I need to um, come up with an idea of what to put in those little guy little tiny holes but then I used stickers to embellish everything this one says shine. We got a little butterfly and a little bat, a little snake, some kundalini energy. But um, <laughs> there's a little mouse. And of course, I used some of these amazing little Dollar Tree flowers that Lori was so kind enough to send to me. I've got the word spooky here's a feather and i use the word spooky because there's nothing spookier to me than a spider even though it is a pretty spider but i am just not a spider kind of girl so that when i placed that on there that made it spooky <laughs> and uh you know that was fun it was just a cute little project to make and then you could like glue it down on just like two edges like that put it in the corner of your journal page and then you've got a great tuck spot to tuck a large journaling card or a piece of ephemera whatever you've got hanging around so um it's just fun quick and easy it took me like five minutes so sometimes when you just are in need of an extra little piece you know so you could do a few of these up and have them put up and then when you're decorating a journal you've got pieces to pull from so and that's what I tend to do with most of mine. And uh, I am just so excited to see what everybody else has made today. I hope that you all are having an amazing day. And thanks for stopping by. Bye.